walking trophy. Yeah, your friends them a walking trophy. Then I gotta say, girl, you know I say you're pretty from your band. Walk out. Hey YouTube, it's your girl Queen P. You already know what it is. I'm back with another video. And this is basically um, a video about Teen Mom, Young and Pregnant. I've been watching that for a minute now. I'm currently, I think this is season two. Um, this is some crazy, like I used to watch 16 and Pregnant. I was watching 16 and Pregnant. Um, when did I start watching 16 and Pregnant? I know I was like early 20s when I started watching it. And, you know, I enjoyed it and everything. And then it went on into Teen Mom and then Teen Mom 2. And then, of course, it came back to like OG, um, Teen Mom OG, you know, which was the original girls that first started it off. Um, so now we're on Teen Mom Young and Pregnant. And it is so crazy to me how I'm how I'm almost 30 years old and you know I used to enjoy watching this you know and now I'm just like taken back because the new generation of this teen mom is just so mind-blowing okay so let's get into it so the first one we gonna get out the way real quick is Rachel the one with the two baby daddies who don't know who the baby daddy is and is going back and forth with the baby daddies or whatever. I'm just like, when I first saw her, I was like, OMG. You know, when I heard her story and everything, I was like, no. Like, what is going on? What happened to these people? You feel me? So, and Rachel, her family is just thrilled. You feel me? Like, they talk to their mama any type of way. Her sister, Mallory, she has a baby as well. Oh, my gosh. She be cussing out her mama. Okay, she tried to fight her mama on the last episode I just saw. You know, but her mama didn't put her hands on it. She just told her to get out her house. But, yeah, she tried to fight her mama. Called her mama to be and everything. You know, always dropping her baby off by her mama and everything. Going out to party and, and hang with dudes and stuff like that. But the thing is, their mom, you know, was never around. She was on drugs and all this. So now she's, she's wanting to be, you know, a mom. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, she's trying to be a friend rather than a mom. You know what I'm saying? Because she was never there for her kids. So now, you know, she's just trying to be a friend, basically. You know, so now she's trying to be the best grandmother that she can be because she was never a mom to them. So, yeah, I was like, oh, my God, Rachel is so sad. I'm sorry to say that, but she really is sad. You know what I'm saying? She don't want to take the DNA test. You know what I'm saying? To figure out if, you know, that's the daddy. If the dude that's in the picture right now is the daddy or if the other dude is the daddy. She don't want to take no DNA test. Because she don't want to find out if it's not his. Because he was like, well, if I find out that it's not mine, then I don't want nothing to do. You know, have a part or whatever. Things are going to change. So I was like, God damn. You know what I'm saying? But eventually she's really going to have to figure out who the baby daddy is. You know? These girls are still young. These girls are like early 20s. You know, um, I think Rachel might be the youngest. Um, I think she's like 17 or something like that. 17 or 18. You know, but these girls are really early 20s. You know what I'm saying? So next we have um, who we have next. We have Brianna. She's the one. Um, the uh, She's she has some issues too she has her son um bryson the one he's the little baby he has a missing um limb which is his arm and everything and she's doing good she also has some interactions with different dudes or whatever you know with that situation um she recently just found out who her baby daddy is you know what i'm saying so i'm still trying to figure that all out and how that's going to process you know what i'm saying so yeah and then um, we have Ashley, you know, Ashley is from, um, California, you know, her and Bar, you know, have their little baby Holly, which is so cute. She is so freaking adorable and she is so smart. She is so smart. The last episode I watched, she was like, rice, rice. <laughs> 
she's so cute holly is so cute and she is so smart to be so young you know what i'm saying and they treat that baby bar i already know he gonna be like the best dad because he don't play no games you know what i'm saying he's like he sound like an old school parent you know that is really really young you know what i'm saying like when people go through stuff growing up and see how you know people raise kids and how kids are today like people really th bring back that old school parenting and even though bar bar i think might be like 24 or something like that i don't know how old bar is but you know he's like a old school parent you know even though he's young you know what i'm saying because we see how you know, people parent nowadays, they want to be they, they kids' friends, and, you know, people ain't got time for that, you know what I'm saying, you know, people ain't got time for that, you know what I'm saying, we got to bring back that old school parenting sometimes, you know what I'm saying, um, so then we have Kayla, you know, Kayla, she found out that she's pregnant, again, with her second child from a different dude that she's with now, um, but I think this might work out. You know, this dude, he got stuff going for himself. He's colleges are looking at him because he played basketball. So, um, you know, they're looking at him. He's in love. I hope he's in love with Kayla. You know, um, if everything goes good with his basketball scholarships and everything like that, he wants um, Kayla and, you know, the baby you know, to come with him wherever he goes, you know, wherever they send him. So hopefully that all works out. You know, I'm still watching, you know, and everything like that. Um, who else do we have? So I did Kayla, I did um Ashley, I did um Rachel. Um I think we have one more. Let me think. I forgot. I'm trying to think who's the other one because I just did Kayla. I did Rachel, I did Ashley, um, I did Brianna, no, Brianna, yeah, Brianna is the one, um, the son with the missing limb, I think there's only four of them, I think I did everyone, I think I might be missing one, let me see, and then we have Kyra, which is the one that's in the relationship with the, with the girl, um, she has issues with her baby's daddy, which is who is incarcerated at the moment. And she had issues with, you know, his mother. They bump heads a lot. So, you know, she really does not want a part of his family. But eventually she's going to have to deal with, you know, that side of the family eventually. You know, like I said, they're all young. You know, they're just going to have to grow up and, you know, get it together and good thing that her mom is trying to be the mediator and, you know, mend things with them. And a girlfriend is, too. She's trying to help as well. But um, they just have so many issues and everything. But, yeah, I've been watching, you know, Team Mom Young and Pregnant. I really have been trying to, you know, get back into it. But, you know, being 30 years old and, well, almost 30. I'll be 30 in, 30 in June. Um, So being 30. 29 and a half <laughs> I guess years old um it, it's just really different for me to watch it when I be it's really different for me to watch it rather than when I was watching it when I was like 21 years old you know 20 years old it's real different now because you know we've been there we've done that so when we see these 16 year olds or you know these 18 year olds 20 year olds get pregnant it's like and then they're 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 talking like this or they're doing weird things you know what i'm saying it's like oh my god i really hope this these kids grow up and get it together you know what i'm saying but i still watch it i still enjoy watching it and everything like that um it is weird for me you know it's weird you know because especially when i saw rachel's part oh my god i laughed through her every time she come on i laughed through it because they just whoo the first episode I watched <laughs> when I tried to get back into this I saw her episode and I just could not deal with Rachel like you know what I'm saying but hopefully she grows completely up because how she was acting and how she is acting oh my god like Rachel is a hot mess you know what I'm saying she really was especially when she said that she when she said condoms are expensive 
You know what I'm saying? I was like, girl, who cares if condoms are expensive? Go get some. Get on some type of birth control. You know, you out here having sex with multiple people without protection. You know what I'm saying? And now you don't know who the baby daddy is. You like really playing these two dudes. You know what I'm saying? And everything like that. And just going back and forth. Whoever is not in the picture, she'll go to the to the other dude. And try to get him in the picture. And if he don't want to be in the picture, he'll, she'll try to go to the other dude and try to get him in the picture. You know what I'm saying? And she was just going back and forth for a minute between both of them saying that you're the dad, you're the dad. You know what I'm saying? And it was just, it was just crazy. It was a hot ass mess. But anyways, but yeah, what do y'all think? Do y'all watch Teen Mom Young and Pregnant? Any of y'all watch that? You know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, I'm on season two right now. Um... Let me see what episode, what episode am I on? Season two, episode six. So, um, yes. But anyways, what do y'all think? Do y'all, do y'all watch this? You know, do what, <laughs> you know, it's crazy. Um, so make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl if you're not already subscribed, you feel me? And I'll see y'all in my next video.